Welcome back to Kung Fu Maintenance. Going deep today, right into the French drain gravel well. This is our condensate drain gravel well. The muck and mire. Yeah, lots of fun. Yep, condensate drain leak. Well, first thing you want to kind of determine is it coming from the pan? Is your leak in the pan? Is it overflowing the pan? Or is it overflowing the vent? Oftentimes these are vented below for a couple reasons. And uh, one of them is so you can get a wet dry vacuum in there and be able to clear it out. Uh, it's got a trap on it and as you can see this one's clogged at the vent. Now uh, what that means is the clog is further down the line. If it was just at the pan, you could pull it from the vent doing what I'm, you see here. And a lot of times what you can try to do is, is uh, vacuum it from the vent and then plug it at the pan. So that way you're pulling it all the way back to the gravel well. So this one, that didn't work for me. I wound up pulling it at the gravel well at the uh, loop deal that comes out of the top. And I'll explain it a little bit more. But um, here it wasn't pulling any suction, which is no fun. If it did, what you want to do is block the vent so that it pulls all the way to the, the drain pan. But this one wasn't even getting any suction to the vent, which means I had something else going on, which requires a, a deeper look. Now I was able to flip the vacuum in reverse and convert it to a blower. Problem is, uh, you know, when I did that, water came shooting up out of the vent, so I had to turn that off in a quick hurry. All this meant it was time for a deeper look down in the French drain. It's a gravel well. It uses a, a tube. This one's an ABS tube uh, with rocks down all the way down in the tube and then a screen over that. Now this one I had to pull the, the tube apart which is very tricky. Sometimes they don't come apart. You know a lot of times you can vacuum from the tube end and clear it but sometimes uh, it's like I said, just very, very tricky. I was lucky enough that I was able to move the PVC off the end of this as there's a T and, and an extension that goes down at the bottom and then a loop that comes up over the top. The theory is that if it overflows, it'll overflow out of that T. And right here is where I was able to hook up my vacuum and pull it all the way through to the vent and beyond to the pan. Anyway, this one vacuumed down to the screen there. There's a screen on the bottom. Cleaned that out and scraped all the muck up off the bottom. Here it is, me checking it the next day. And even though it was raining, AC drainage is draining really good. Even though we had a lot of groundwater and everything, it still was keeping it nice and clear. So always kind of good to follow up and double check on something like this if you can. But anyway, that was a story cleaning out that screen on the gravel well. The rest of the story was a whole lot of cleanup. Yikes. Can't all be easy.